1949, the U.S. forces dropped the world's first atomic bomb in Hiroshima, claiming the lives of hundreds of thousands of people in an instant. Let's go up there. <laughs> I mean, I don't think we deserve it <laughs> for bombing. We didn't do it. We're American Jam. We did it. It's like the only, it's the place we've been to that's like the, pretty much the in-between of like the modern and the old vintage type, I don't even know if vintage is the right word, it's like the ancient type stuff, traditional stuff, all in the same place. The Sekusa is awesome. You can find anything you're looking for. You can find ninja swords and kimonos for your dogs, or Tokyo bananas and ice cream burgers. Ice cream burgers? Where? Right here. Oh. Little did I know this would be the last time that I would see her. In all the hustle and bustle, I lost her. With no way of getting a hold of her, I did the only thing I could. I called the police. Just when I started to lose hope. There you are. Everyone was happy for us. But none as happy as our new friend. What? He's looking at me. Honestly, I, I was looking at what's in the box. I looked up, and I swear his eyes followed me for just a second. I shook. <laughs> just take me. Reunited, we walked into the temple gardens. Things took a turn when this lady walked up to us. Remember her face. I know I will. At first, I thought she was a fan. Thought she recognized me from TV. See, there I am, on TV, right there. We just got robbed in yeah. Sekusa. By <laughs> some religious bitch. She uh, she comes up to us and like gives us one of these, and then uh, puts bracelets on us and then asks us for money. And we didn't have money, so she took the bracelets back and crossed our names off some list. I had one 500 yen coin. And she saw that. And wanted and, it. And wanted it. She's like, that one. And I'm like, no, I'll we give you a hundred. <laughs> so we just got robbed. And that's the name of this video. <laughs> the grave of the of Toda Moshio. I'm really good at Japanese. Oh, cool. Alright, for some reason our plane crashes and you guys find my GoPro. That's what I want. Well, good for good luck. Okay. You don't want the hamster one there? No. <laughs> We just experienced the biggest heartbreak of our time in Japan. 
We spent a, literally about forty dollars on a crane machine trying to get a pump on corn that we could have bought for forty dollars. <laughs> it didn't work out, and I'm so mad about it. Well, we made some friends. There's yeah, so we legit played like ten times. It's two dollars a piece or something. Wait, we, we went we went and played more than that. It's two dollars a piece, and we ended up spending like forty dollars. So you do the math. And then there's these there's this couple that was just watching us the whole time laughing because we kept getting so close and getting really mad about it. But now we're gonna go spend our money over there at Sega. But we set a limit to eight dollars because uh, we still gotta get home. <laughs> That machine made fools out of both of us. <laughs> oh, Cham also ran into a, host, a hostess club. She found a girl that she liked. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> Alright, let's check this place out. I think the, the ones are downstairs for the gaming ones. Well, we wouldn't know how to play any of the games. I think she's underestimating my Japanese. <laughs> Forgetting that I spoke 100% fluent Japanese, I figured out the game. All by myself. Figured it out. You can turn it off, I have no idea what I'm doing. But this came out of the machine, so it must have been a good thing. Now Jam's gonna try to play, we'll see what she does. I loved our time in Tokyo and I have a few more videos coming out from our trip. Please subscribe for more content.